By now, you understand a large earthquake is expected to rock the Midwest. The New Madrid Seismic Zone is a cluster of fault lines that run through Missouri, Tennessee, and Arkansas. It's the most active seismic area in the U.S. east of the Rockies. Every year, hundreds of small earthquakes occur in the zone. Until the brick hits you in the head, most people don't react. And these small earthquakes do not do a whole lot for increasing the awareness that this is a real threat. Even a medium-sized earthquake could impact as many as eight states in the central and eastern U.S. So the, the emergency management community, I wouldn't say they're totally prepared for this, but they're aware of it and they're trying to prepare for it. It's kind of hard to prepare for a disaster of this scale, but you know, they're trying. There are seismic stations across the country and the world to help study activity in the zone. Experts tell us research and education are the best ways to prepare for a large scale event. Whether it's sheltering, transportation, uh, could be some evacuation issues, um, getting resources into the impact area. Those are all shared problems that we're going to have to deal with. Memphis Light, Gas and Water is a good example that they've invested millions of dollars in federal mitigation dollars working through the State Emergency Management Agency to address their risk. But the best thing you can do is remember the drill. Drop, cover, and hold on. You know, the seconds that you're standing there thinking about why is the ground shaking, unfortunately things are beginning to fall. Well, I wouldn't lose that much sleep over it because yes, you're living near a seismic zone and there could be a large earthquake that can cause damage and could cause injury. But we don't know whether that's going to be tomorrow. We don't know if it's going to be 100 years from now. So, you know, it's not something I would, I would stay awake at night dreading. Um, it, it will eventually happen.